is the free weekly BBO Winston tournament for the week beginning November the 3rd, which is today. So we're going to play it. It's a little early in the day for me, but we'll see. This is like 1 o'clock. I'm just hardly awake. I have 15. We know by default partner has 15. Um, I have great minor cards. Partner has great major cards. We belong in no trump, I think. And 15 opposite 15 is 30. We could have 32 if he had 17. We're going to take advantage of the fact that we know he doesn't have 17 to just bid 3 no trump. We could bid 4 no trump quantitative if he'll pass. I don't guess it matters. Um, we'll just play three no trump. We're not getting the slam. And we have the ever popular pause. I will cut the movie and restart when they start playing again. Okay, we're back there. Let's see. So it looks like we're, unless that's from fourth best. We have four spades, two clubs, three diamonds, and a heart. So let's play small here. It's no use to bid up the jack if West led away from the queen. We we still can't uh, pick it up at that's fourth best. And if the, I mean if East, and if West has the king or queen of hearts, and we score four spades, we missed a slam. So let's see how this goes. So we'll duck this one here and see how lucky we get. Okay, so we got four spades. That could have been a fourth best. We need to unblock the diamond suit eventually. But we might lose two hearts. We don't unblock it too early, so we're going to use a hard entry to dummy, I mean, spade entry to dummy. All right, so now the like like I said, the the rest of the hand is is easy. It, we either lose uh, two hearts or one heart. Uh, I can throw away the ten of clubs on the diamond eventually. Uh, I correctly unblock diamonds. I probably should let the ten of spades and the spade to the jack. This is probably a slight mistake. Um. I don't need to get back over here at any time. So I'm going to leave the 10. Maybe I'll cut. Oh, okay. So we're going to lose two hearts. I just lose the two hearts. Which is probably good for us. Now I can afford to unblock the diamonds. Also have a spade entry back over there. And we'll give him a chance to win the second heart. Well, we came close to being able to make a slam here. Okay, so now we're good. Um, King of clubs, and we can have a spade and heart entry. Just claim. Well, we can't. Yeah, so okay, that, that worked well. I wonder what people were doing. Let's take a look. Oh, they found their heart fit. Yeah, you don't need to play in, in heart. When you got 15, your partner's got at least 15. You don't necessarily need to play in the 4-4 the, the four, four major fit. Never occurred to me. Okay. All right, so uh, Bergen's starting points. We have 10. I think Bergen actually subtracts a point for Doubleton Ace Jack. I don't. Um, and we have a quality suits plus one, and we have a five court suits plus one. I guess I'm going to open a club and maybe reverse into diamonds. I'm certainly strong enough. I always get in trouble with reverses with robots. I never know exactly what's going on. 
even though they just tell me what their bids mean, seldom does it mean what I think it means. Well, that one I know what it means. Um, I don't have a spade stopper, and he didn't bid no trump. I'm bid three hearts. Four no trump. He's not playing with some kind of slam in hearts. They can have three hearts. I have a good two hearts, though. Black wood for diamonds. Okay, I have one, two, three. Which is, uh, they play that as uh, five clubs, I think. Yes, five clubs. Five no trump asking for kings. I've got the king of clubs. Six clubs. Six diamonds. I have no more kings. Although I do have a, a suit here. So we've got the ace queen of diamonds. And uh, if he doesn't have the king of hearts, I might be able to get rid of all of his spades on my club. I guess I'm going to pass. I'm thinking about seven there, but eh. He might have needed two kings. If I had another king, I would have bid again, I think. Well, they found the spade lead, and the club isn't going away, so obviously. Um, I might be able to throw two clubs off, two spades off dummy if clubs are 3-3. Three, three. I take the ace-king-queen, all the clubs fall, and I get two pitches. If that fails, then I can rough that one. If that fails, then the uh, heart finesse. So I've got two chances to make this game. Um, one is the heart finesse, one is the spade rough with even clubs. If there's a singleton jack of clubs, small to the ace drops the jack. Um, can I do a dummy reversal here? Rough two hearts. Okay, well, we're going to win this one. So, is there anything else? I may need two roughs and dummy, either two clubs or one club and one spade. So, I don't think I can afford to play three rounds of trumps. I might need to get lucky and catch a 3-3 uh, three, three club split or the hand with four clubs have only three spades, but even then that might not be enough. Okay, we'll win another diamond. Let's see how bad they split. Oh, I should have won that one high in the dummy. Guess it's real bad. Okay, so now I'm going to try the clubs. I can rough the third round with the king, with the ace, I mean. Well, now I'm at the crossroads of the hand. Do I try one more club, pitching a spade? If they rough this club and catch a spade, I'm down. So what I'm playing for is the person that has four clubs, if either one has four clubs, also has three spades. That's a little bit against the odds. The reason against the odds, he has four clubs, the other one has two clubs. There's more room in the hand with two clubs to have the long diamond than in the hand with the four clubs. But if rest roughs this one, I can over rough and then uh, try to heart finesse. So I, I think it's I take the straight fifty percent chance. We'll see if they both fall. Okay, we'll see what happens.
where we were never making, no matter what we did, we were going down. So we went down an extra one. Uh, so it's... We can claim it'll be, you know, 10% at best. 7%, yeah, to work. So we're about average. Um, you can't make it. Maybe I should have... I didn't want to bid three and that's without a spade suffer, so then robot put me in slam. That, those things happen. Uh, starting points, we have 17 high card points. We lose one for here. That's 16. We have a five card heart suit. That gives us the 17. We could open this hand at no trump, um, but I've got an easy two diamond rebid, so I'm, I'm but with this 5-4, I'm just going to open our heart. Partner bids either black suit or no trump. I got a diamond rebid without getting too high. Not good enough to jump to three hearts. Well, now my hand is uh, gotten considerably better. Partner supported heart, so I get one point for having two doubletons. But he hasn't bid spades, so I can't do any extra points for spades. So for my 17 high card points and one suit is, I lose a point and gain a point. I got 17, but when he supports me, I get a point for the two doubletons. That gives me the 18. So I um, think I don't want to pass. It's a long way to three no trump. I mean, it's a long, it's a very short way to three no trump. Um, let's say he has 12 if he's max. I can rough the heart. Got no heart losers. In clubs, he can't. In diamonds, he can't have but three points. The queen jack. So most of his, most of his points are. He's got two hearts or one heart. So most of his points are in the short heart. I think I'm worth a game try. Um, because he's only got three points in diamonds. Probably none in hearts. He's counting one of his 12 points as his doubleton heart, or three of his up to 12 points. This is a pretty good hand for the two diamond rebid. I, I have to bid again. I think I just bid four diamonds. Leave it up to him. Four hearts. Three hearts. Oh, geez, he showed up with three hearts. You think, who amongst us think he has three hearts? Hold your hand up. I see no hands. I also think he has a doubleton heart, but queen doubleton heart would be adequate support, and heart score more than diamonds, so let's try the four heart contract. If he has three hearts, I've got to pass. I don't think he has three hearts. Yeah, he's lying, son of a gun. Um, okay, so we've got one club loser. We're going to have to catch uh, no worse than, we need two two diamonds, as well as the queen, or if they're not two two, I need the queen of hearts on side. I need the queen of hearts on side. Okay, well, that's good. Now I can survive worse than 2-2 two, two, uh, diamonds if heart split 3-3 three, three or 4-2. Okay, so I've got, an, I've got a heart loser, a club loser. I'm going to just leave him with his heart. I has got the king of clubs entry to dummy, although his diamond split is so bad that... Well, now we're... We're good.
Well, this worked out pretty well. Much better than perhaps it deserves. Probably a good job raising me to. And all of us that didn't raise our hand, we said, who thinks he has a third heart, we're right. So on board two, um, probably got a little too excited after our diamond, after our reverse. And heart bid. I wonder how others people bid that one, actually. I need to go back and check that. Well, this one's not good enough for reverse, although I got good shape. Um, I don't even get a chance to open East open in front of me. I guess I have to bid two no Trump. That's about as this is actually a weak version of the two no Trump because I'm vulnerable. Uh, this is about as if I was just a tad bit stronger, I'd overcall a minor or two diamonds and rebid three clubs. But here I just bid two no Trump. Well, all right, we're done. Partner knows that we had a good hand. Well, I don't know what the robot knows. I would, this would be sort of along the lines of a minimus bid here. Maybe I should bid uh, four clubs here, but I'm going to trust the robot. I think the clear is out of spades. I really do. Probably might have a diamond void. That, but I mean, that can't be to have a diamond void. Um, all right, we're forcing rough and dummy to shorten his entry to spades. I mean, if he's going to rough and dummy. Probably still thinks I can rough that one. I should have a club. Need to keep my diamonds, actually. Clara's got a buku of diamonds. We are fresh out of tricks. Declare could claim, or I could concede. Well, I was clearly supposed to rebid uh, four clubs on this one. Right. Not a good game here for us. Let's see how we do on this one. Not good enough to open a no trump, so I open a club. All right. So the choice here is between a no trump and a spade. Spade might be too encouraging. I bet a no trump. Well bid. Less than less than eleven high card points. I bid three clubs. I'm not too excited about my hand. Maybe I should have bid three no trump. I don't know. Well, I shouldn't have bid three no trump. I don't think he underlaid the ace. So we'll try the jack. You count your points. Your partner had uh 10, 14, we got 24. That leaves them with uh, 16. East has got uh, four of the 16. That leaves 12 points out. Those 12 points are probably most, if not all, with West. Certainly the King of Spades, we think. Yeah, King of Hearts. Don't rough this. Okay, my thought here is I want to do a dummy reversal. I win a heart, two heart roughs, four clubs in my hand, the king of diamonds, and hopefully two spades. 
So I'm going to go about that with roughing a hard high because the east is out. And we'll go ahead and rough a heart really big while, we have, while we're over here. Eight of spades. We need to rough one more heart. Let's see if we can afford to rough it high. Cash one high. We'll cash the king of diamonds. We'll play a club to the ace. Okay, well, we'll play for one of the club spade on this to be on side. I think the king of spades is over there anyway. Oh, this is an. Um, when I've got spades, I open a diamond because I can always rebid a spade. Or I'd be in a better position to make a rebid. Okay, so how good is our hand in support of spades? Well, let's count. We've got two doubletons, that's a point each. A five card suit, that's worth a point, that's three. A quality suit, that's worth one, that's four. And then we have four, eight, twelve, three, four, fifteen, sixteen high card points plus four is twenty. Looks like a four spade bid to me. So we got three key cards, that's five clubs. Okay, I hope the six spades is better than our last six diamonds, which was a total disaster. Well, this one looks a lot better. Takes a 4 split all sides here, it looks like. I will get a count on the spade suit. If he says four spades to the jack, we're doomed. But West has it. So we can actually claim. We uh, All the diamonds are good. I got the queen of diamonds. I got the king of hearts. I got the jack of clubs. It's just a bumper. We got a ten of diamonds. Diamonds can't split bad. So we're claiming. Okay, so that last hand was good because we, you know, count up to 20 points, and uh, that's why people miss slam. Uh, use Bergen points, that was easier. Here we have a normal one hard opening bid. You can't open a no trump, got a singleton jack. ACBL would kick us in the butt. Invitational. We want to try for slam. Let's count our hand. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We don't get anything for that, so we got fourteen working high card points. Seventeen, seventeen working high card points. The six card suit is. I get three. I get one for the. I get two here, and then when he supports, we get another one. Three more points. That's twenty. And I get two for the doubleton. That's 22. That looks like another four no trump. And 22 ups 10. Five hearts. He has two with no queen. But we have enough trumps. One, two. We have to pick up the queen of hearts. So if we bid slam, he's got the two aces. That's eight of his uh, 12 points, 11 points. We're going to bid slam. We, we have to find the queen of hearts. If he's got four, if he has four hearts, we're golden because we have ten between us. It's just not. It's just got to bid it. See how we do. Now we got a club loser and our heart loser goes away. Okay, we think. 
Hope they don't get rough a spade on trick two. Uh, got a diamond. And we still have the problem with the uh, queen of clubs. It looks like I miscounted my points. I had 14 high card points, not counting the jack, not 17. So instead of having 22 points, I only had 19. That's why this slam is a little iffy. Let's see if I can recover. Well, we got to try. It's a guess. If this hearts are 3 0, we have to guess who has three. And as I sit here, I don't see a good way to know. Um. Did Wesley ace of space from shortness and length? I think he probably let it from length. And he returned the two of diamonds, the four of diamonds. So diamonds are probably a f uh, more of them over here. Why are more of them over here? Because he led low. So we're going to play small in case he shows you out. And he did. So the logic there, uh, spade ace probably more likely from length. And then the four of diamonds, but five diamonds over here. So why I led low here. So the good news is we guessed hearts right. The bad news is we still have a club loser. Um, so what we want to do is we want to uh, pick up the missing heart. Okay, I don't think we... Now I'm going to try to play for a squeeze. I want to trick East into popping up with his only honor. Be it the uh, King of Diamonds. And West has the Queen. It would be perfect if he pops up with the King. That would be great, because then I can squeeze West in clubs and diamonds. That's my current plan. King. King or Queen. King or Queen. So the thought here is I'm going to try to play for a squeeze on West uh, in clubs and hearts, uh, clubs and diamonds. You, you said long diamonds, we think, but we think West had one of the top two honors. Maybe the king, we speculated that earlier. Now, if he also has the queen of diamonds, I mean the uh, queen of clubs, we're in good shape. Um, so now we're going to cast a jack of hearts. It's really not a quite squeeze position, but we'll try it. We're watching for the And you see a lot of high clubs here. And it didn't work. If the this king of diamonds was over here, it would have worked. He couldn't have kept the king of diamonds. When I cashed that last spade, he'd had to, to throw away a, a club guard or the king of diamonds. So the squeeze would have worked if he had uh, the king of diamonds. But we know here it's the king of diamonds. So... We just want to used to pop up with whatever his high diamond was, and he had to have only one. West had to have two, so the squeeze would have worked uh, had the the diamond on us been as we hoped. Another seven percent. Well, you can't win them all, and this is one where we're not going to win. Well, we have fourteen. We're not going to upgrade this to no trump either. Um, if you really wanted to get fancy, you could say, well, you got a uh, quality suit. That, that gives you an extra point. That's 15. And it would simplify the auction a whole lot, but we're just open a club. And the question is, will we raise one spade to two? Or we'll definitely raise one heart to two. If it's one spade, um, the question is, would we raise the two? Well, we could actually pass one spade. 
is a possibility. I think we'll do that passing. Okay, they're going to have us play no trap. I think we have four club tricks, a heart, and two spades. So we, we shouldn't make. We might be able to get another heart. If he says the king of hearts, he won't be able to return a diamond. And if they attack diamonds too early, we can rough a diamond over here, although they can always play ace and a spade whenever they want. We have 14. Our partner has seven. It's 21, so they have uh, 19 high card points. West has shown up with three. We suspect West also has the ace of spades from the opening lead. So that's seven of their uh, 19. East, let's uh, see, nobody opens, so uh, nobody can have more than 11 at the most. So it could be 11. Eight, ten, nine, eight, eight, something like that. I seriously doubt they'll let us run for diamond and dummy. So if he had the ace, king of spades, ace of diamonds, that would give him 11. And I think he would have opened. Well, he, they don't open with 11 some first seed draws. That would give him 11. That'd be his max. So we think the Ace of Diamonds is over here. I fairly strongly think the Ace of Diamonds is over here. I'm going to uh, log off and log back on. And we're, we're back now. And like I said, we're pretty sure the Ace of Diamonds is all sides, but we can actually set up the Eight of Diamonds so we don't actually have to rough it. Cover with the Queen, they can get the Jack, and then the Eight will be high. So uh, we don't even need to... They, they pre they're going to prevent us from roughing a Diamond, but they're setting up a Diamond for us. Don't know if that doesn't really do it terrifically for us. But Now Diamond back to the Jack and my... Uh, my ace is good. So he's got the ace, king of spades, queen of diamonds. That's nine. If he had the king of hearts, that's 10, 11, 12, he would have opened. So we know the king of hearts is over here. Now, we didn't know where the king of hearts was until we found the queen jack of diamonds. We're assuming he has the queen jack of diamonds. Even if he doesn't have the jack of diamonds, that would still be 12. That wouldn't be 12, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, that would be 12. So the king of the king of hearts is in this hand. Um, I guess now was the time to cover. Because it sets our jack up anyway. We don't need to get over there. Well, we can force them to lead the next round of trumps for us by leading the diamond. We know the king of hearts over here. There's no use to lead a heart up to the. There's no use to lead a heart up to the king up to the uh, the thing there. So let's threaten to rough a diamond. They'll lead another round of trump for us. And probably then switch to a heart through us. We'll just tuck that one and lead the diamond. Okay, so he, he won't lead he doesn't have time to lead a heart. He's gonna lead a uh, at least one round of trumps. Here it is. Does his partner follow? No, so he's got another trump. Oh, we don't have an entry in that hand. That's that was clever. Two of diamonds. Well, we win the eight, and now we pull the last trump, and they threw a club. So yeah, we can claim all but one. They're going to get the king of hearts, and as we'll see at the end of the hand, he says the king of hearts. Let's take a look when the hands show up. There's the king of hearts. Okay, so analyze the hand okay. And we didn't get into trouble in the auction.
Well, we finished above 50%. Where did we go on the last hand? Um, I, I went down an extra trick there for no good reason. It probably didn't matter that, that great for the score. Uh, here, I was a little too conservative not bidding four clubs. I went partner bid clubs in my six-card suit. But we were vulnerable. I, I sometimes watch vulnerability too much, especially in these games where everybody bids. The field was bidding four clubs. I should have bid again. Well, it wasn't a bad slam. I mean, it was because we had three clubs opposite three clubs. That was the big, biggest problem. Um, and this one uh, was, was fairly easy. I don't quite know why that was so good. If I raised the two spades, partner would pass. I was never rebidding on no trump. 